हेलो स्टूडेंट हाउ आर यू ऑल आई थिंक दैट वन क्लास और टू क्लास वी हैव डिस्कस द इंटीग्रेशन दैट वाज डेफिनेट इंटीग्रेशन नो इनडेफिनेट इंटीग्रेशन ओके एंड टुडे इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस द इंटीग्रेशन बट दैट इज द डेफिनेट इंटीग्रेशन ओके डेफिनेट इंटीग्रेशन फर्स्ट वी हैव टू नो दट इज द डेफिनेट इंटीग्रेशन एंड वी विल टेक द सम एग्जाम्पल्स एंड रिलेटेड दैट वी कैन प्रैक्टिस द क्वेश्चन ओके सो वी हैव क्वेश्चन आई हैव रिटर्न यर द डेफिनेशन ऑफ इंटीग्रेशन योर डेफिनेट इंटीग्रेशन इट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द वेल्यूज ऑफ द इंटीग्रल इंटीग्रल ऑफ ए गिवेन फंक्शन एफ एक्शन फोर एंड अपर वेल्यू बी and a lower value a of the independent variable x suppose that if there is the independent variables and then if there is given the limits okay suppose that a and b there are two limits then we differentiate this ones in yes, certain integrates and then we will put their limits okay upper limit and lower limit just like integration that is we can write i is equal to integration of function of fx dx a to b and then if you will integrate this one the function of f dx so you will write capital f i have written and we will take the okay related this ones f x and we have this is the this is the lower lower limit okay and this is the upper limit upper limits okay so we can uh, differentiate because we have written here upper values and lower values both we can differentiate function that is the uh, b minus a b minus a then we can write here okay so suppose example okay examples i'm taking if we have the integrations uh x dx suppose that first we are taking integrate x dx and limit you can take uh, a b yeah, or any numbers suppose that if a and here is the b then you will integrate this one so you will write the integration you know that x dx integrations x dx integration what you will write x square okay very good and the power will divide so you will write x square by 2 and give the square brackets a to b and now either you can take this okay half common here if you will take half common so here will be half then x square and then a to b so here will be 1 by 2 and then put this value here b minus a okay but the square is here so a and a you can give or this you can write also or also you can multiply it's up to you okay so both will be answers next suppose that we have another questions x square if we take the second questions integration of x square at dx and here is 0 to 1 okay 0 to 1 then what you will write this ones so same process you will write okay what we have done here you take this is the uh, x square so here will be x cube yes because this power here will add 2 plus 1 divided by 2 plus 1 and then 0 to 1 you write down so power will add then you will write x cube by q and limit you write on 0 to 1 so you can take the common here then here will be 1 by 3 then you have x cube and 0 to 1 so 1 by x equal to and here you will write upper limit minus lower limits we have taken 0 to 1 0 to 1 so you will write 1 q minus 0 q and then okay solve this one you will write 1 by 3 and here will be 1 minus 1 minus what uh, 0 why because 1 q means 1 and 0 q that is 0 so you will write 1 by 3 into 1 minus 0 and finally you have 1 by 3 okay so this is the value that we got another you can take suppose at the place of x square you can take any numbers if you will take the numbers another suppose that integration of x to the power 5 dx this is the numbers 
and some process you can take here here one two two suppose that this is the value then what you will do as you have done similar process you will do here so you will write here x to the powers 5 plus 1 and 5 plus 1 and then a square bracket here will be 1 to 2 okay so again you will add this power so here will be x to the power 6 by 6 and then you will write 1 to 2 okay you can take common here 6 if you will take common then here you have x to the power 6 and 1 to 2 so you will write 1 okay 1 by 6 and then upper limit minus lower limit means 2 to the power 6 minus 1 to the power 6 this you will write okay 1 by 6 and here will be multiply 2 times 6 times 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 1 2 3 4 5 and then 2 2 to the 4 4 to the 8 8 to the 16 16 to the 32 32 to the 64 64 minus 1 that means you have 63 by 6 this will be the answer okay students so according to like that the questions you can solve i think that you should write this question and okay if you have pen copy then better you write down or you can take captures also okay shall i start the next question okay very good if we have the another questions then you take another question suppose that we have integration of okay fourth one integration of a to the power x dx and 0 to 1 this you will integrate then what will be the integrations so first you integrate this one then here will be e to the power x dx you will write here e to the power x and here will be square bracket 0 to 1 this will be enough and now you will write the upper limit minus lower limit so here will be e to the power 1 minus e to the power 0 okay and you will write if you know that e to the power 1 that is the e minus you know that if uh, the power is 0 so that their value will 1 what 1 it will be now if the power if uh, the powers will uh, then you can write here okay so here will be 1 so this will be answers because this is a similar process you can take another questions if it is you have the questions related sin theta and the cos theta okay so sin theta and cos theta you can take also suppose that we have integrations of integration of 0 to pi by 2 and you will take the sin theta sin theta at the place of theta you can take what you will take x dx okay x sin x dx so you will integrate this one same process what you have done before it two questions so you know that the integration of sin so here will be minus cos okay very good so you will write minus cos okay minus cos x and limit is 0 to pi by 2 okay now you will put here upper limit minus lower limit so you will write here upper limit you have uh, minus you can take common okay minus you can take common so here will be cos x and then 0 to pi by 2 here will minus and you see that here will be cos pi by 2 minus cos 0 degree okay 0 degree so you will write minus pi by 2 that is the cos 90 degree minus cos 0 degree what is the value cos 90 cos 90 0 cos 0 1 so here will be 0 minus and minus this minus plus 1 and finally you have 1 means integration of integration of 0 to pi by 2 if there is the sin x dx so their value will this will be the value okay means 1 but in same process if you will take at the place of sin you will take the cos if you will take the cos then okay if you will take the cos that is the integration of same take limit 0 to pi by 2 
and here we will cos x dx. Can you can you solve this question? Okay, you should try. I think that this question. If you will take this one, then here will be. This is the just reverse. You can say. Okay, so here is the cos x dx. So here will be sin x and then limit zero to pi by two. Okay, zero to pi by two. We will write here and now solve this question. Okay. So if you will solve here, then we have the sine pi by two minus sine zero degree. Okay, means sine pi by two means ninety degree minus sine zero degree. Okay, put the value. What is the value of sine ninety? Sine ninety one minus sine zero zero. Okay, so subtract this one. So here will be one. Okay, more questions you can take. Okay. More questions we can take. Okay, this side I am raising here. If you will take in the forms of x square, okay, then what will be the value? If there is the one by integration of integration of zero to one, one by one plus x square and dx. This is the direct formula. What is the formula of that? If you will take this one, then you know that this is the tan inverse. Okay. Tan inverse x, no, okay, and put this limit zero to zero to one. Then you will put here at the place of x zero to one. So here will be tan inverse one minus tan inverse zero, okay, and put this value. Tan inverse one, you know that the one one that is tan forty five, no, okay, very very good because. Tan 45. If you will take the angles, then you know that tan 45 degree is equal to one. Tan tan 60 degree is equal to root three. Yes. And if you will take tan zero, that is the zero. So here will be what you will write here. You can write here uh, pi by four. Pi by four. Why? Because 90. Yes. Here will be 90 and Uh, again, you will divide by two. That means directly you can write pi by four minus zero. So here will be pi by four. Okay, same process at the place of this. Okay, one plus x square dx. We had this value. Okay, but you can take another also. One question I am giving here. There is integration of zero to root three one by one plus x square and dx. This is the questions. Okay, similar question is that, and same process you will put. Only there is difference in the limits. At the place of one, I have taken here root three, and you, as we know that the value of tan root three we have. Okay, that means you will take the tan sixty degree. Is it clear? Okay, students. So thank you. Solve these questions. Okay, and we will try to more questions solve. related your definite integrations and you must revise and always try to attend this class okay thank you